guys, I wanted to do a quick haul video for you today. I have a basket full of goodies that I've picked up over the course of the last few weeks and I wanted to share all of them with you. Um, please excuse, I just ate something and I'm looking at my lips and I'm pretty sure I have lipstick like all over my face. Sorry guys. <laughs> Um, but I did want to share all the stuff that I picked up. I have another haul coming up in probably a few weeks once I get everything in. Uh, one of my subbies and I, we chat on Snapchat and um, through the Snapchats he's actually helped me find some really good buys and so I'm going to share all of you guys, all of those with you guys coming up soon. Um, and so yeah, stay tuned. Um, so if you don't subscribe to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you get updated when that video gets posted. Also, if you don't follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, you should, uh, because I love chatting with you guys and sharing some of my adventures with all of you. So I will put my usernames here somewhere um, for you guys to see and make sure to follow. Anyways, okay, so let's get to it. So the first thing I want to show you guys are these New Balance sneakers. I've really been wanting a pair of New Balances, and so I figured these were the ones to uh, get because I love the color combination. And they're more, much more of a spring color shoe thing, but nevertheless, um, I wanted to show you, get them, um, even though it's like winter. And they're gray with the perfect baby blue. It has the N in the baby blue, the shoelaces in the baby blue. Um, but I love them, and I actually got these at DSW, and I think I paid like, I don't know, like $40, $50, like at most, um, at DSW. I thought they were such a great color, um, and I also want to get some, um, other ones that are burgundy, but TVD. I've been turning into a little bit of a sneakerhead lately, and I've been obsessed with so many different varieties of sneakers, and so I'm slowly collecting more and more of those and uh, if you subscribe to my channel like I said I'm doing my shoe collection videos and one of those will be my sneakers so stay tuned for that. So when I was in New York I went to the J Crew and Madewell sample sale and I picked up two things at the Madewell sample sale nothing at the J Crew sample sale um, and the first thing at the Madewell sample sale that I got is from a brand called Retro Super Future and they are out oh, I just pinched myself. <laughs> they are eyeglasses. Um, they actually have no frame in them. I mean frame. Uh, no lens in them currently, but I am due for new eyeglasses and so I thought that these would be really cool ones to have. They're gray. You can see they're made in Italy. Um, you can see what they look like on me. Hopefully you don't think they look horrendous. They're great. They're a little actually now looking at them in the camera. I don't know if I like them. Whatever. I got them for $20 at the Madewell sample sale, so they were a really good deal. And the idea would be that I would just add my own lenses when I finally get a new prescription. I actually broke my eyeglasses that I used to wear like all the time. I'm sure if you watched any of my other videos, you saw me wearing them. I broke them this morning because I fell asleep on them and the arm just like snapped off. And they're like Tom Ford, so I'm like, fuck! I really need new eyeglasses. Um, so, we'll see. We'll see how this all unfolds. Um, also from the Madewell sample sale, I got this jacket. It is this super, like, rounded, amazing material. You can see it has a lot of sheen to it. Um, I don't know what the um, material is because, I mean, it's a sample sale, so a lot of this stuff is sample. So there's the same kind of tags and lining that would normally be in the item aren't there. It does say that it's a medium. Um, and I'm pretty sure I paid like $35 for this at the Madewell sample sale. And it has both a zipper and this little like claps, clasps. Um, but I just love, I just love, love, loved what it looked like. Like the, the boxiness of it, the satiny material of it, the fact that it has kind of this like golden mustard uh, lining on the inside, this f like frilled edges and um, the material feels really luxurious and so even though I only paid like $40 for it it feels like a lot heavier than that so I love that then I went to opening ceremony and I bought two pieces one of them is this Rodarte t-shirt and it says je am Rodarte je déteste uh, Rodarte, which means I hate, and I got it in a medium. It was $125. I know that's stupid. I spent $125 on a t-shirt, 
but I really love these shirts and I have a different one that says like just Rodarte on it and when I saw this one I thought it was so cute and I mean I wear t-shirts more than I wear anything else so if I'm gonna invest in anything like it doesn't make sense for me to invest in high heels that I never wear and then not invest in the t-shirts that I wear too that said every other one of my t-shirts comes from Zara and it's like twenty dollars so <laughs> there's that and then also from opening ceremony i got this amazing 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 uh kind of uh, letterman jacket it's from their uh their like water i forget the name of that collection um i don't know it's a men's jacket actually um and i got it in a it's a men's large okay I, it fits me so there goes my self-esteem um, but it's it's oversized it's meant to look oversized um but it's this beautiful jacquard i think that's how you pronounce that material in like a fantastic whiny burgundy and black and then it has big oc for opening ceremony letters at the chest um it is the material is so just phenomenal i just love the colors i love the texture i love everything about it i love the way it fit i love the fact that it's oversized it looks really good on like i tried on a few of them and i got this it was on sale i got this for 255 dollars regular 425 dollars and i'm telling you i really 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 love the way this looks i also tried on a black and white one that was not on sale and because of this material and because of this print and everything i thought that this looks much more like luxurious and glamorous than the other one too it had a lot more character to it so love it then I went to Zara and I got these lace-up shoes. They were $49.90 and the reason that I got them is because I've been really wanting to try out a block heel but I didn't want to invest in a block heel because I wasn't sure about it. And so they're just these lace-up uh, flat, almost flats. They have like a two inch little heel there and it's a block heel and it has the lace-up. It comes to just right above the ankle and then it has these little like gold tips at the end. Um, I don't know. I really like them. I think that they're super cute. Um, they're like a black, almost suede material, but they're obviously not suede. They're from Zara. I don't know what. what it's Zara uh, Chafaluk. So I think that's like their cheaper brand. And I got these in a size 38. Um, but I think this will look so cute with like almost anything, you know, jeans or um, whatever, whatever whatever basically when i was in new york i was wearing the cutest outfit and part of that outfit consisted of these loafers that i have and that i hadn't broken in up until that point and when i'm in new york i walk everywhere i love walking through the city i don't care if it's pouring rain i don't care i love it it's like it revitalizes me like gives me life um and so i um I was walking around in these shoes and I got the worst blisters of my life. Like I was like bleeding from my foot. I felt like I was like the original Cinderella when they were like gonna cut off her feet or whatever. Like that was the true story or whatever. Um, and that's what I felt like. It was horrible. <laughs> it, I was in so much pain. Like I was moving in slow motion because I could not like lift. My, I was in. I was in so much pain. I was in so much pain. Um, I, I couldn't wear like the rest of the weekend I couldn't wear heels I couldn't wear anything like I was in so much pain and the first place I went is I bought a pair of socks right like, like to like put them on with because I was wearing them like with those like tiny little like under socks you know which was an idiot move of me and so I went and got like real socks like thick socks but at that point it was too late it was too late my feet were going to fall off I was in so much pain I was in so much pain um, and so that didn't work so then I went to Ricky's and I bought a bunch of band-aids um, because I was like oh my god I need to do something to like heal my wounds I'm I have wounds um, and so I bought a bunch of band-aids and I like covered my foot up like I might as well have bought like a like what, what is those band-aids that they wrap around people's feet or like you know like a uh, gauze I should have just bought some gauze like I, I like put like regular band-aids like all over to like protect myself um and then finally after that I was like okay I need to like nothing is gonna work I need to take these shoes off um and so I went into the Adidas store and I had actually been wanting a pair of all white shell toe Adidas and they had them in my size there and my feet were so desperate to um get out of the shoes that I was the loafers that I was in that I put these on and I will tell you now you don't know what it feels like to walk on clouds until your feet are going to fall off 
and you put on a pair of Adidas shell toe sneakers. Um, so obviously I've worn these already. Um, you can see they're a little dirty at the bottom and I already have one of my little um, stinker fillers in there. These Adidas shoes basically saved my life. I have never been so grateful to be able to pick up a pair of shoes. I don't know how much they cost. I think they were in the $70, $80 range. Um, but since I brought them home, I've worn them a ton and I love them so much. They were literally a lifesaver because I was going to murder myself because my feet hurt so damn bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, pick these up at the Adidas Boutique in Soho. So the last thing I'm going to show you guys in this haul video is this amazing deal that I got at Topshop. Um, so I think you guys have seen my Aquazura lace-up flats, my black ones. Um, I got them. They're classic. I love them. I wear them all the time. But uh, Topshop did kind of their knockoff version of them. And I found these on the sale rack. The only ones, they were in my size, which is like, what are the odds of that? In Which is a 38. Um, and it... They were $35 and then they were an additional 20% off and then I got my like student discount. <laughs> um, and they're blue velvet and they're basically just like an exact knockoff of my Aquazura shoes, like almost identical. They have the little gold detail um, on the laces there. And they have a zipper in the back. And you can see, oh no, see look here. They were $24. See, I knew that I didn't pay $35. So a sticker in size says $24. They were regular $48. And then, like, I don't know how much the student discount is. It's like 10 or 20%. But then I got that in addition to everything else. And then I bought them in New York and everything under $100 has no sales tax. So I think I just paid like $21 for these shoes. And they're so cute. They're so pretty. They're so perfect for the winter because they're like this navy blue velvet I mean like come on for 20 something dollars like had I known that the knockoffs look just like the real thing I wouldn't have bought the real thing um <laughs> whatever uh but like look how cute those are and I got these at Topshop I know right that's everything in today's haul thanks so much for watching guys like I mentioned in the beginning of the video make sure to subscribe like I mentioned in the in the beginning of the video, make sure to subscribe to get way more fashion-y and haul videos. And also make sure to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat to get all the updates on all the stuff that I do. I love chatting with you guys both on Instagram and Snapchat and um, in the comments below. So leave some comments below. Love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye!